Hi, and welcome to this tutorial on how to navigate your way through the IMO bookshelf. At the top right, enter your login details provided to you by your distributor and click Login to continue. On the home page, you can find some brief information about the IMO bookshelf, a link to our worldwide distributors, and a link to all the latest IMO titles. You will also notice that all the menu items on the left-hand side are now available. Let's click on Index in the main menu. Here you will see all the available IMO digital publications grouped by category. I have my eBook selected, which will show all my purchase titles. When the star is clicked below one of the titles, this will then add that title to your favorites list found on the left-hand side main menu. You can also click to view superseded titles as well. Hover over the image to see a more detailed summary of each publication. If the button below the title is grayed out, please contact your authorized distributor to purchase this particular title. If it is blue, it is available to open. Let's click on Open now to view this digital title. Just note that if it's a larger publication, it may take a few moments longer to open. You can see that the chapters are visible on the left-hand side, and you can click on a chapter to jump directly to that specific section. When viewing each title, you can also do such functions as viewing in full screen, copying a page to your clipboard, and adding annotations such as highlights and notes. Back in the main menu, we have the capability of doing a library search. This button gives you the option of searching multiple titles for specific words or phrases. By typing in your query, the system will find all titles where your term can be found. In this instance, the IMO bookshelf has found 44 separate titles with references to ballast water. Clicking on the publication will list all the instances where your term is found, and links are located throughout the search that, when clicked, will open the title in a new page with a list of where your search term can be found throughout the publication. Next, let's click on Download Library in the main menu. The Download Library will list all your purchase titles and show you those that have been downloaded and will be available offline. More about the offline application, though, in another tutorial. Here you can download each of your purchase titles to your browser cache. We recommend that you have a strong internet connection when doing so. Once downloaded, these titles will then be available offline. If you clear your cache at any time, you will need to download the titles again when your internet allows. By clicking on Saved, you can sort the titles to display all those that you've saved locally and you can click on Save All to download all of your purchase titles to your browser cache. If you select Delete, this will delete the item from your browser cache and you will need to save it again to be able to view it offline. There, now all your purchase titles should be available and ready to reference offline. Next, if you click on Account, you have the option of creating a new username, alias and password. This is very helpful for companies or departments that have purchased multiple licenses for concurrent user access, and rather than having staff remember the login email and long read code password, you can personalize the username and password for your team to remember more easily. We really hope you enjoy the ease and flexibility the new IMO Bookshelf provides. Please contact the IMO sales team if you have any questions or comments about this tutorial.